Hello party people, we are at the nicest Target that I know of, uh, scouring the Target dollar spot, and they are probably going to restock. They do have Christmas stuff, but um, I already shared with you guys the Christmas decor. So right now I'm going to share with you all of the Christmas stocking stuffers that they have. So I hope you enjoy shopping with me. Pumped guys, it's all the stocking stuffers. There's a few aisles of this. So I am just going to breeze through it as quickly as I can, but also appreciate all of the details that Target puts into their crap. This bag of coal, I don't think it's edible but I saw some edible coal over here. I think it's Tootsie Roll. Ooh, this one's double crisp. Mmm, delicious. Probably tastes just as bad as coal, okay. But for a dollar, I like the gag gift element of that. And then over here, I thought these were wax melts. They are not, I'm still unsure of what they are. A Melty Elf, and they also have a snowman. Oh, it's putty and elf pieces. Oh, that's cute, but. All right, moving on. So they have a gingerbread man. They also have a melty Santa and then a melty snowman I saw, but I bet you those are the first ones that are sold out. So there's the melty snowman. I can't even explain the texture, hold on. Okay, it's the Sculpty foam. They also have these, which would I think be really fun in a stocking stuffer, in a stocking stuffer. You guys know what I mean. Winter sand, oh, it's that, um, is this Play-Doh or is that, or is this the connect sand? I don't know, it looks like Play-Doh to me, but one for a dollar seems like not a good deal. Moving along to these little squishies. Ew, snowman snot? I also saw reindeer poop, which was brown. So I assume this is like, um, uh, like slime, I don't know. They've got some pencils and these, which are always a hit. Let me see if I can find different kinds. Okay, so I found three. All I want for Christmas is you. All right, I won't sing that much during this video because I know how much you guys loved it before. Um, they also have this pink one and then this ho, ho, ho with Santy. I call him Santy. I don't care what you call him, okay? Here's some glitter pens, a book of stickers. Ooh, more Elf on the Shelf pencils. Those look fun. Some Grinch stuff, erasers. He's a mean one, Mr. Gr oh, gingerbread cops. I don't even need cups, but there's gingerbread men on them. How cute is that? Oh, these reindeer, happy holidays. Oh my, how much are these? A, do a dollar, are you kidding me? Oh, how can I not get those? My husband's gonna be so mad at me. Okay, chapstick, elf chapstick, no less. Oh. And the abominable snowman. Oh my gosh, bat bombs! I don't, I can't contain myself. Oh, you guys, Grinch bath bombs? Three dollars? Oh, how am I gonna get out of here without blowing all my money? Okay, here is a reindeer, oh, abominable snowman. Frosty, he's my favorite snowman. Frosty the snowman. Oh man, that's so fun. All right, more pencils. Ooh, a mini little coloring book here. $3. Oh my gosh, great option. Great for traveling if you're in the car, taking a little winter vacay. Okay, there's some little squishies back there. What's this guy? Oh my gosh, it's Santa in his sleigh on wheels. That's amazing. What? It's the little truck. I wonder if you can connect them. This is a little truck with lights and all the presents up top the food truck back there. I feel like that's left over from summer. <laughs> All right, what are these? That's an eraser set, and they also have those mini erasers back. <gasps> a gingerbread man eraser. So cute. I feel like I always throw like half of them away though. <gasps> what is that? Okay, I picked them all out. They are bathtub finger paint soaps. Just look at the packaging. Oh, Target, I love you. You get me. I've got a paddle ball game, another coloring book. Oh, these are great books. These are a dollar. And of course, you know, great is subjective, but for little kids, it's just a little board book. You know what I mean? There's probably like two words. Give you a little sneak peek there. That's like half the book right there. Oh, this looks really fun too. Frosty the Snowman. You can design your own, uh, whatever that thing's called, stocking. <laughs> course oh they have they also have the Grinch and then ornaments felt ornaments and there's two in this one that one's really cute Lego piece 
sets. I gotta tell you, these went really quick just from the hour that I've been here. It feels like Black Friday or something. Um, $3 for each set. I know they're gonna restock because, hello, it's not even the end of October yet, um, but this is a great deal. Oh my gosh, and then this one, this, I feel like my kids would have so much fun with this because, of course, it's like marketed well, a bell popper, but really, don't they poop or something? Doesn't it come out of like an odd part of their, oh no, it comes out of their nose. Ah. Me and my, my dirty thinking. Oh, little Santa Claus? Comes out of his face too. I don't like the way his, he looks. I don't like that. That's not the Santa I know. Okay, a little candy cane filled with candy. Tradition. All right, some fun tins there and some printed tissues. I bet every kid would love to have those in their stocking. Uh, some Elf on the Shelf Band-Aids, yes. Oh, and there's Rudolph Band-Aids in there. Always fun to be festive when you have some boo-boos. And then more, you guessed it, stockings. Okay, I pulled a few out for you so you can just take a peek at them. Cute. Staying on the stocking theme, they have these, which are, I think, the biggest stockings I've seen in the dollar spot section so far. So the front, I guess you can color them, which I think is a great little activity for kids and have them get really excited about stocking stuffers. I'm trying to peek on the price there. It's $3 a piece, and they are really cute and very large for $3. Oh my gosh. Are these supposed to be little elf shoes? Stop it! Why are these one size? Wait, they say lady slippers? They should have them in kids. That would be so stinking adorable. Um, these are lady slippers, apparently, and they are, well, I don't know how, I don't know how much they are, but they are cute little elf shoes. And then they have little beanies. There they are, a reindeer, Santa, an elf, and then that striped one in the back there. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. Those are great. It's definitely beanie season, right? And $3. And these are really getting me hyped. Baking sets. <gasps> oh, okay, so first of all, these silicone molds are expensive just on their own, but these sets are $5 a piece, and they come with a mini little whisk and a mini little spatula there. I don't, is this supposed to be shaped like that? Like a, is that supposed to be a butterfly? I'm not, in, oh, maybe a gingerbread man? I'm not entirely sure. I don't know. I didn't make it, but there it is nonetheless. It's very, very cute. And then they have a second little baking set over here with a rolling pin and cookie cutters, but these are like mini cookie. Is that a deer or a moose? <gasps> I'm falling in love. Oh my gosh. That little rolling pin though, seriously worth $5 on its own. <laughs> Am I wrong? I showed these in my previous haul, but they have little, what is that? They have little snowman hats that you could build a snowman and then accessorize him. This is everything included, the hat, the scarf, the carrot nose, coal eyes. The only thing missing is a corn cob pipe and a button. Well, the buttons are there. Okay, so Christmas advent calendar. Well, this is technically not a calendar, but it's an activity pad and there's an activity to color or I don't know, do an activity every day before Christmas. Keep your kids busy for like 10 minutes. Okay, here are some more stocking stuffers. Really excited about it, as you can tell. Um, felt food, and there's money, and there's a little, what is that, like a, like a table cover? What? They're getting real fancy with their felt food here. Oh, are you kidding me? Is that an oven? I want this for myself. Flour, sugar, gingerbread. You guys know how I feel about gingerbread man and sugar cookies, all right? Um, pizza, not so much. That must be leftover from summer or something. <laughs> all right, I feel like they always have these magical fours. Well, not technically these exact ones, but it's a tin set. Another thing, great for travel. Keep your kids busy. You open it up and there's little magnets inside. It's wonderful. Oh, some more felt kits. Oh, okay, okay. Get this pizza out of here, dude. I put the sugar cookies up front to get people in the spirit. Okay, this is a doctor set. Oh, so stinking cute. All right, what else have you got? Another pizza. Get out of here, no one wants you. All right, just doctor sets. Oh, these are cute. Some more felt play sets. These are fairly easy to make yourself if you have felt and have to cut it up, but come on. Why would you if it's already made for you? There's a little gardening play set. All right, some wooden food. I'm partial to breakfast foods, but they also have um, hamburgers and fruit and, stop it, and pizza. Get out of here. All right, they also have this. 
these building blocks in here, which is a real doozy if you try to organize them the same way to, you know, put them back. <laughs> Almost impossible. It'll probably take you longer to organize them than it does for your child to play with them. Just a heads up, because I've tried it before. Um, a slingshot with these snowballs. They usually sell a pack of these snowballs, which I feel like may be here because it says snow toys. Um, there's like a pack of 10, I guess, for three bucks. But a couple different options here. A reindeer and a snowman. It's like a slingshot that won't hurt you, right? A slingshot that hits you and you're like, ooh, that's fun. Let's do it again. All right, they have these little empty art notebooks. Um, and then these wooden toys, which are, oh, ooh, these are magnets. <gasps> ABC magnets? These might come home with me and then end up all over on my kitchen floor. Um, these little letter boards as well. These are actually really expensive, like Melissa and Doug style. So to find them in the dollar spot is always fun. These lace people, which is always great for fine motor skills. They have a couple different sets of them. Oh my gosh, and of course, I'm gravitating toward Christmas style, those elves. Oh, look at all the ones you get in there. Oh, I love that. That is $3. They also have kid socks, a set of them. Not just one, a whole set for $5. So four socks for five bucks. And they are, of course, adorable. What's on that? I don't even know what animal that is, but boys and girls. They've got these cute little stuffed animals for three dollars a piece and then oh, ooh, a fun little blanket okay these blankets are no joke i want to snuggle in one right now they're five dollars and they come in four different prints so i'll show you these two boy girl and then um, boy girl this one i feel like is more neutral i would be pumped to get that blanket in my stocking stuffer just saying alex if you're listening okay so this is more bigger girl items berry frosting what is this i don't know what that is a powder poof it says for three dollars if you know what that is um a lip balm set oh my gosh a whole set for three dollars where we saw earlier um it was one for a dollar um a lip gloss trio oh my gosh i just i feel like i'm a little girl i want all of this body glitter in a spray is it the 90s again because i'm feeling nostalgic Okay, these are the scents that I found, but I have a vanilla in my cart, so I know there's more. Candy, Dreams, Berry Frosting, and Snow Flurries. Um, yeah, I feel like my girls, they're getting to the age where this kind of stuff is fun for them. There's also glittery, gl really, can I speak? Glittery Bubble Bath. Is it glittery or am I just pretending? I'm just pretending it's not. I wish it was. So berry frosting, sweet treats, which obviously is my favorite for gingerbread reasons. Uh, candy dreams, I don't even know that, oh, they're all scented, but I'm sure they're different scents. It just doesn't tell you, or unless the name of it is the scent. Sweet treats, candy dreams, and berry frosting, I assume. Ooh, fashion headphones, hello. Those are so fun. A nail art kit. Oh, oh my gosh, look, little elf guy back there. He is cute as can be. Four, okay, let's talk about this for real because for $3, you get nail art stickers. Oh my gosh, and they're festive. Look inside, I'm shaking, I'm so excited. Gingerbread man, little, I'm trying to study it. That box, I can't even see my eyesight. Oh my gosh, candy cane, a lollipop, snowflakes. I love everything about that. At the Dollar Tree, I think I saw some at the Dollar Tree. They're a dollar a piece, obviously. And then you get four nail polishes on top of that. Oh my gosh, and those are glittery. And the stickers are different. Oh, how can I choose? Okay, I'm moving along before I combust. These are stationary kits. There's unicorn, snowman, and then these cute little dinosaurs. So that is everything that's included in the kit. A case, a pad. Oh, oh, here, there it is, picture style, because who wants to read? Check out what's inside, I love that. <laughs> it's like, hey, you don't wanna read, turn me over, and you'll find out what's really inside. Okay, some markers. These better be scented, all I'm saying, okay? Oh, these aren't just markers, they are um, like little stamps. Oh man, I used to have those too. Some more nail polishes back there, <gasps> and gel pens. Hello, I feel like the 90s are coming back, just saying. Is this an eraser? No, look at that cat back there too. It is an eraser. It's the biggest one I've ever seen in my life. 
Okay, they also have some card games, Go Fish and Old Maid, two classics. And I feel like these are always um, a good staple to have. These Magic Ink, don't get ink anywhere. These are also great for the car because they, well, for the little ones anyway, they get to color, but they won't make a mess of anything. So I see some Disney princesses and then some more beanies. These are more stylized. So like Star Wars and Paw Patrol and LOL dolls. What's up here? Vampira. Is that a new thing? That's not Christmas. Get out of here. Oh, Jojo. I feel like she has taken over the world. And then some matching games right there. More card games, Crazy 8. And then this foam stuff again. That's pretty fun. Ooh, some coloring books. I haven't seen these in a while. I also don't really shop the coloring book section. So I don't know. <gasps> what? Is this what I think it is? It's not, but it's even better. A kid's shark soft. What? A blanket. Oh my gosh, this one is steep. $10, but can you even? for this little shark blanket. Man, that's cute. All right, some more coloring books there. Ooh, these are great too. These little party, a party pack, party pack. Little shimmer and shine on there. Always be brave. Ooh, what are these Star Wars? Ooh, it's a whole doodle and stationery set. May the force be with you. It's three dollars for that set. Oh, Stretch Armstrong. Hello, little Hulk and Avengers in there. They also have little bottles for your kiddos. Oh my gosh! And they are actual. They're not plastic. Are they plastic? I don't know, but they're three dollars. They they don't feel plastic. Oh, this Peppa Pig one. Oh my gosh! Stop it, man. This is cute. How can I? I don't. Mm, I might have to take this. That is really cute. <gasps> And as I put it down, I want it, but if I wanted, if I got everything I wanted, I would be bankrupt. Okay, um, you have to pick and choose. This backpack is really cute too. Ooh, a secret notebook. Yes. But it's not lined. That's my biggest thing. Like I want lined paper. I mean, it's good for doodles and stuff, you know? Ooh, a diary with a key. That is pretty fun. Here's the other diary with a key and it says, I'm not even sure what it says, shine on I think, it's a little unicorn. Very, very fun. Ooh, and then the fun winter stuff that we never need here in Florida. Actually, it's starting to uh, get a little colder. It was like 70 degrees this morning. Hmm, am I making you jealous? All right, remember our summers are like miserable. So they have these uh, ear warmers, these ear muffs in all different styles. Oh my gosh, is that a rain? No, that's a dog. So cute, the little bear. Oh, this guy is really sweet too. Any more that I'm missing? Oh my gosh, is that the abominable snowman? <laughs> That's awesome. And then they have these really fluffy socks. These feel so nice. Oh my gosh, so one pair is a dollar. And then these scarves. Is that a scarf? Hey, oh no, it's an infinity scarf, even cooler. Oh my gosh, I might get some of these for the girls. They only have two, no, 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 there's, there's a lot more down here oh, and more of these kids blankets oh so a blue shark blanket before was it gray it was gray oh that's it that's it okay they have some mittens and paint your own bank they've got paw patrol and lol they have some minecraft beady kits these lol bead kits spider-man that's always a good activity if you want to keep your kids busy for a while because those take a while. They have these surprise kits. I'm not really sure what that is. Mix and create fun lip gloss. Ooh, that's actually really fun. Lip gloss flavors. That's really cool. For three bucks, it's a good DIY. Okay, last but not least over here, some fun uh, inflatable games. I thought that one's my favorite. I haven't seen this one before. That snowman where you throw the balls in his belly. And then some snow chalk marker. That seems really fun. Okay, this is one of the last things. And guys, we're getting ripped off here. Polar ice, grow your own ice cubes. Come on, really? Are we that naive these days? This is $3 too. You could grow your own ice for three dollars <laughs> and then watch it melt uh, really you're just paying for the fun experience there's a couple more of these so they have grow your own snow and then i don't know let it snow what do you grow your own maybe one of the cutest things i've seen the holiday sweets memory game so there's a peek of it on the back and that is just so stinking adorable they have a couple more games ski lifts and slopes and then village elves i want I'll collect them all. So those are $3, guys. And that is the last thing I have to show you. 
So thank you guys so much for hanging out and watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye. I lied, here's some memory games. Jingle Bells Bingo! And Santa Search. Oh, that's fun. So that's like a memory game. All right, guys, that is everything for now. But be sure to stay tuned because I'm sure, look, she's still stalking over there. All right, there's more to come.